on in the type of government uh, where the leader exerts the greatest control over the lives of the citizens. Then moving on, we have review the characteristics of a democracy listed below. Indicates whether each characteristic is associated with a direct democracy or a representative democracy by writing for, demo, for direct democracy or R for representative democracy in the blank provided. So in the first one here, we have in the first one here, in the first one here, we have all citizens can propose laws and the proposal becomes law if the majority approves it. What kind of democracy is that? That should be um, a direct democracy. A direct democracy, and that is we go forward, we go forward. All right, a direct democracy. The next one says citizens elect representatives to serve in the city body. That is a representative democracy. Delegate acts on behalf of the citizens expressed preference. That is also a representative democracy. So the next one we have citizens own the authority to veto laws directly. And that is what? A direct, that is a direct, that is a direct democracy. So we can see this question, these are the questions we have. There, the types of government, which is one, the first one is option C, which is, the first one is option C, which is dictatorship. And the second one, you can see all powers, um, all citizens can propose laws, and the proposal becomes law if the majority approves it. That's the direct kind of democracy. Come yes. join the our online classes. Law. They're absolutely the free. So you can join our WhatsApp channel. I'm going to leave uh, the link to the WhatsApp channel in our profile bio or in the video description box. And please do like and share this video. All right. Our classes is every week, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Wednesdays for RLA, Thursdays for your for your um, math, Friday for your science and Saturdays for social studies. Come join us so you get your GED out of the way. All right. So today's topic is we are on the civics and government and we're looking at historical and modern government. See you in our next class.